Hello everyone. So we're gonna talk about Shiba Inu and I'm gonna talk about basically like what's going on today, like the current news, basically why it's been like unstoppable lately. So we're gonna cover why I personally think it can still double from here. It still has um, a lot more room to grow. It's still a little bit early. Um, yeah, we picked up a lot of momentum, but if you're just sitting on the sidelines and you're thinking of maybe getting in or maybe not getting in, I feel like long-term wise, it's still, still early. If you're doing some like trading or you just feel like getting in and out real quick maybe wait for a little bit of pullback um, i'll cover some technicals in a, in a little bit i'll cover basically like the prices that you should look for if like if you want to get in or get out you know type of deal we'll cover some technicals we'll also cover like what's going on with Robinhood, like Robinhood news and lastly i'll also showcase my portfolio basically i'll showcase how much i'm holding how much i'm up and basically just talk to you guys a uh, like if I plan to hold, plan to sell, when I'm planning to make my moves. So before we get into it, I just want to emphasize I'm not a financial advisor. This is just for entertainment purposes. Make sure you check out my channel, Your Options Guy. So lately I've been covering Shiba Inu um, more because it's just been getting like crazy attention and it's just been literally unstoppable. It's kind of like on steroids lately and it hasn't like dropped. Like a lot of people are expecting it like to, to just drop already or like just be like, you know, a quick... Um, like a like a phase basically kind of like how uh, doggy coin had a phase but then like it maintains or its price somewhat <laughs> it had some stability so yeah so basically uh i'm gonna talk about shiba inu today and make sure you check out like my other content as well and if you're interested in buying shiba inu i like in my last video i talked about how to buy like a pro and where to buy specifically so make sure you check that out as well also check out any of my recent popular uploads where I talk about like how to videos of like how to use margin and stuff like that in Robinhood or sell some puts, do some covered calls, stuff like that. So make sure you hit the subscribe button, leave a like and leave any comments if you have any questions. All right. So Shiba Inu. So basically it's up again. It's, it's up 18% today. It actually hit a high around like 50. So I think 50 is the new strong resistance. So if we take a look at like what's happening, so you can see that the market cap is now risen to 19 billion, which is kind of insane. Like a month ago was like barely 4 billion. So as you can see, it's basically number nine uh, in popularity in terms of like in coin, Coinbase popularity. If we take a look at like market cap in terms of and like what's going on in Coinbase. You can see that Bitcoin is number one, Ethereum number two, Cardano number three. Tether is, is really close to uh, Cardano. Solana is also really close, and then Polkadot. Then there's Dogecoin, and then just two spaces below it is Shiba Inu. So Shiba Inu has been like rising basically from the ashes. It's past Ethereum Classic, it's past Filecoin, Axe Infinity, it's past Polygon, Bitcoin Cash, you know, some big names, Litecoin. So it's just been rising and rising. And at, at, like if you look at the technicals, which I'm going to showcase in, in a second, it pretty much looks like it's somewhat unstoppable lately. Everybody has been consistently buying and holding. Um, it's just been breaking all these resistance levels. It's been on a crazy ride. So yeah, like Shiba Inu, like everyone's saying like, yeah, it's, it's the doggy coin killer. But it, as of right now, it's looking more like the altcoin killer. It's just been beating all these altcoins like like one by one by one. And sh I feel like it may... It may get close to being doggy coin so as you can see doggy coin is at 34 she was at 19 so a little bit less than double and she but you you know, can overtake doggy coin so whatever whatever price it is right now you have the potential of, of doubling your money if it passes doggy coin so again that's one reason why shiba Inu can definitely double from what it is right now once it passes doggy coin and not only like passing doggy coin will be like you know just like a somewhat of a psychological like level to break through but i feel like mainstream wise it will it will cause a lot of headlines everyone will be talking about it they'll be like hey shiba inu just passed doggy coin shiba inu is like overtaking it you know it's it's the new doggy coin is better than doggy coin i feel like once that happens it's going to surge even more because of the popularity maybe even some doggy coin fans will shift over to shiba inu or just buy it for so another reason why shiba inu definitely has the capability of doubling if not you know tripling or more from what it is right now if we take a look at basically how many people own doggy coin so according to this this article back in august 30th which is actually not that long ago 
There's a total of 4 million on-chain holders of, of Dogecoin, and it says, however, only a small number of extremely wealthy entities own a passive part of the supply. I think I read somewhere where like, like this one mysterious person owns like 80% or something, or like a huge number of Dogecoin by, by themselves. But any, anyways, the point I'm trying to make is that there's 4 million on-chain holders of Dogecoin. Now, if we take a look at how many people own Shiba Inu, it says there's less than 800,000. So if you just compare and contrast in terms of market value and like the terms of holders uh Shiba inu is doing relatively well because there's there's a small amount of of holders yet the market cap has risen so much it's it's getting really close to hitting value coin status and it's not even like at a million yet so just imagine like once it actually gets listed on Robinhood, like like robin hood has as you can see it right here it says approximately 22.5 million users so just imagine if like you know a small number of that you know like a million of, uh, just of them just basically start buying shiba inu once it's listed then then boom the price can definitely surge like double or triple like what it is right now all right so there's two reasons why robin hood is, is basically inevitable inevitable that it kind of list uh, shiba inu and along with other uh, cryptocurrencies but for sure shiba inu one is because of the popularity that shiba inu is getting uh, because as you can see it says right here kindly request the robin hood to list shiba inu coin so there's already been like more than 300,000 signatures and when i started covering this it was way less than 300,000 it was like at 200,000 if not less so the popularity is just increasing and increasing and as of today robin hood actually reported like their their earnings and basically their their earnings was not good like like at all so it says right here third quarter third quarter transaction based revenue totaled 267 million dollars with only 51 million dollars coming from the cryptocurrency trading and back in the second quarter the, the crypto trading revenue was 233 million so that's basically like five five times um or it's only a fifth of like what it was making back in second quarter so so the cryptocurrency trading has been like pretty much crap in Robinhood lately and i feel like they're really looking to like like what's going on how, how should they make more money and i feel like one obviously bringing other cryptocurrencies to to Robinhood platform will definitely increase their revenue but also shiba inu because shiba inu is, is having so much trading volume that this past like week or it, it was either this week or last week shiba inu in terms of trading volume is surpassed ethereum so the trading volume is huge and not only that it has it has a huge like uh backing kind of like a cult status and you know like the whole shiba army is just holding strong so everyone's just buying right now and i feel like robin is just missing out so they're kind of like shooting themselves in, on the foot like the longer they hold out on not listing shiba inu the, the more money they're just losing all right so real quick let's take a look at some technicals so yeah, it's been unstoppable which is breaking resistance levels after resistance level so ever since it broke like this wedge that or not this wedge this triangle pattern that i had basically broke out out of it it broke 35 resistance it broke the 40 resistance it broke 45 resistance and now the strong resistance is 50 so who knows when it'll break that so it literally has just been like on a huge rise there hasn't been any selling um basically the last selling that it had was when we went from like 0 0.06 all the way to 35 where we basically like times 5x right there so 5 or 6x ever since then um it, it's just been like increasing from the 28 all the way to 50 it's been just like a 2x from here so this was like a 5x and uh, and then after such a huge rise we started seeing some selling finally but then it stabilized However, from here to here, it's only been like a 2x when you think about it. So no one's really been like selling. Um, ever since there were some people that sold out from here, new buyers came into the market and then, you know, long-term holders had just been waiting. And so now it's just basically buying and buying and buying. No one's been selling yet. There hasn't been any crazy news of like to sell or any reason to sell. Actually, just like a couple days ago, Elon Musk basically confirmed that he's not holding any Shiba Inu himself. The price did drop a little bit based on that news but then it quickly rose and so like 
this just shows you that Shiba Inu doesn't need Elon Musk. It doesn't really even need Robinhood, to be honest. Like, like the Shiba Inu is just rising by itself with less than less than a million holders, and it's just been like on like unstoppable rally lately. So it, it doesn't really need the uh, the Elon Musk. It doesn't really need the Robinhood. However, those two would be a plus. Anyway, so last thing I want to do is I want to showcase my holdings. So if you've been following me, you've been you've been seeing that I've been like under a thousand, like back a couple days ago, and now I'm like over a thousand, and I'm it's looking like it's getting really close to breaking two thousand. So it's just been on a rise. So I I bought back when it was like at the point thirteen level around there, basically when it was listed on Coinbase. That's when I bought like that day, and I just been holding, and I'm still planning to hold, and I'm planning to hold up until like Robinhood listing. It depends on what happens when when it finally lands on Robinhood. If it if there's like an epic sell, then I'll probably just keep holding because I know it's gonna rise again. But if if it comes on Robinhood and then it like doubles or triples, I might actually take some profits there. If I do, I'll let you guys know. I'll, I'll make a video of it. But as of right now, I see no reason to to sell as of right now. There's there's no good reason. There's no bear thesis as of right now. Every, like every everyone just buying into this. I have like friends and family are like getting into it themselves because they're like hey man you know what you're right should have gone into this i'll just put in like 100 bucks 200 or whatever and then just hold that because it's not that much money i wouldn't recommend putting your life savings on this i know there's some people who are putting like thousands of dollars like 20 50 thousand dollars into this but um at especially like at the at these levels how like it's risen so much it's it's a little bit risky to do that i mean I would feel comfortable just putting 100 bucks if it drops more maybe put another 100 bucks that's my game plan but you know just just be careful on what you're doing anyway so that's it for today's video if you like this video make sure you give a like don't forget to subscribe leave any comments and i'll see you guys in the next video